Hey everybody, Brandon here from CAD Intentions and in today's coffee break video uh, we're going to be taking a look at the Hisense H9 series 4K TV. They were kind enough to send one over for me uh, to upgrade the living room setup uh, and today we're going to take a look at it. Uh, so far I'm a huge fan. Uh, my son is an even bigger fan. He loves to watch uh, the Paw Patrol on 4K and on this big of a 55 inch screen. As always, I'm drinking coffee in this coffee break video. Uh, I'll post a link to the Kicking Horse uh, coffee blend that I'm using this week. So let's get started and take a look at this H9 series, the H9908 Hisense TV. Cheers! So one of the first things uh, you notice about this TV, uh, besides the size, uh, is the bezel-less design. Uh, I really like the look of the TV, uh, even when it's turned off. Uh, it looks really clean. Uh, there's no uh, bulky bezels or borders along the top or bottom, uh, as well as the sides of the TV. The, the majority of the TV is super thin. Uh, with the only kind of thicker or bump out space uh, near the bottom for the mount as well as the various inputs. As far as inputs, it's got all the standards uh, including uh, HDMI, USB, uh, it's also got a wired uh, network cable slot as well as digital optical, uh, cable TV, audio out, uh, among others. I think after spending some time with the TV now, uh, one of my favorite aspects is the, the overall interface. Uh, it runs on an Android platform, uh, making it super easy to navigate, as well as setting it up. It synced really quickly with my Android cell phone, uh, which made setup and connecting to my Wi-Fi uh, immediate and almost completely automated. Uh, I simply press through the uh, prompts on the TV and the phone and it automatically loaded all of my Google accounts uh, to the TV. Uh, the other benefit of having the Android based platform is the fact that it works with Google Assistant which is built into the TV uh, as well as the remote uh, to be able to quickly ask or say commands. Uh, it also works seamlessly with the Google Home devices I have around the house allowing me to ask Google to play a show or uh, music or something, not only through the TV, uh, but vice versa, connected through the Google Assistant. As far as specs go, uh, as I mentioned before, this is the Hisense H9 series or H9908 uh, model to be specific. This is the 55 inch version. And not only is it uh, 4K, it also has a 120 hertz refresh rate as well as being a ULED or ultra LED uh, giving it a great brightness and contrast ratio. On top of the impressive specs I also wanted to emphasize how easy uh, and enjoyable it was to use the actual interface of the TV. Uh, I had never used an Android based smart TV and a lot of other TVs have kind of a clunky, uh, hard to figure out uh, interface. Whereas with this one, with the Google and Android uh, functionality built in, uh, it saved me a lot of time as well as uh, had a quick learning curve with it being so user friendly and uh, quick for not only boot up, but switching between different applications like a YouTube and then going back to uh, digital TV for football games and then back to Netflix, say for Paw Patrol for my son. In addition to the easy to use interface and uh, Android platform, uh, the remote also really impressed me. Uh, I don't know if you can see this here, but the layout of the app buttons on the top, uh, including one press to get to Netflix, uh, YouTube, uh, Google Play, Tiki Live, as well as editing your picture or sound settings. 
uh, really makes this remote uh, so much easier to use um, than most TVs, especially smart TVs that can have huge and kind of confusing remotes sometimes. So that's just one more uh, feature that I really liked about the TV uh, and think you guys would like. As I mentioned before, uh, I want to thank Hisense Canada for hooking me up with this TV and upgrading my living room setup. Uh, and I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video and will consider Hisense for your next TV upgrade. Uh, I know I will, and I hope you guys do as well. Uh, so you guys can check them out. They're widely available. You can find them at Rowe and Martineau or Visions Electronics. Uh, or just check them out on their website for a dealer located near you. I hope you guys enjoyed the video as always. Uh, let me know in the comments what you want to see next in a Coffee Break video. And don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Cheers!